this might just take two KOs. Let's see. No, Colossal hangs on. Colossal the Chad. Hey everybody, welcome back to VGC Regulation F, where today I feel like this team right here didn't get enough love. So I'm going to use it again because I can, because I can do whatever I want. Uh, basic idea here, this is Explosion Colossal. Um, obviously, we're not going to explode every game. That would be silly. That would be a waste of our perfectly good Colossal. But in any given situation, Explosion is the strongest attack that Colossal can click. Um, so it's here, it does lots of damage, and it's really funny. Um, we're running Dragapult to trigger our Colossal. It's Ghost type. It can't be faked out. It has Surf. It can't be redirected. It's very, very nice. So essentially, what we do is we can um, Surf our Dragapult into our Colossal, trigger Steam Engine, trigger Weakness Policy, get all the boosts, and go off from there. Now this team is all physical attackers, so of course, we're running Chien Pao, we're running Dragonite, we're running Rillaboom, we're running Urshifu. All of these things have weaknesses that are different from Colossal's weaknesses. It's a pretty well-balanced team. If we really wanted to, we could lead Urshifu Colossal and like Terra and go for the Aqua Jet. That's, that would be a pretty like decent strategy we could go for. We could lead like Urshifu Colossal, switch into Xi'an Pao, go for stuff. We could lead Dragon Ball Colossal, switch into Xi'an Pao, go for stuff. Um, because it's, you know, physical, dra physical Dragon Ball 2. It's all really cool. It's a really fun team. Send it to your senators. Uh, hopefully we can get some good battles today and hopefully this will be a good video it's gonna be a good video but hopefully it's a good performing video i am still getting over a cold kind of i'm uh i can barely let me let me give you a, a demonstration <sighs> that's my breathing right now um you know what the only thing that looks like a problem is maybe Incineroar. And, like, nothing else on this team is, is an issue except, well, I suppose maybe, um, like, Ice Shard Mamoswine could one-shot our Dragapult, but I don't think that's very likely. What else do I want to bring? I think I'm going to go, um, I think I'm just going to go Chien Knight in the back. I think that's pretty decent. Um, Urshifu could be really good, but it's hard to justify bringing Urshifu. As long as this isn't, like, booster speed Roaring Moon, I feel really good about this. Oh, as always, guys, go ahead and leave the likes and comments and subscribe. You know, all the, all the likes and stuff, they push the video to all the people. You, you know, you know by now. Uh, I don't like this lead. This is probably the worst possible lead for us. I do not have Protect on Colossal. So what do I want to do? Um... They're just going to fake out Colossal and go for a ground attack, right? Like, there's never any way they don't do that. What if I just switch to Dragonite? That's what I'm going to do. <laughs> Dragonite is immune to that, so that's what I'm going to do. I'm, I'm, I'm sad that this is the one lead that I can't do anything with Colossal. It makes me very sad. But we should be we should get out of this like pretty scot free. Like obviously we're gonna take a fake out in a Dragonite, but that's okay. We're gonna be immune to the ground type attack. Icicle crash. Ugh. Okay, that's fine. What item do you think this mammoth swine has? That's such a weird play. Why did they make that play? Huh. I'm just gonna do this, I think. I don't need, I mean, my the Terra would be nice for, um, for, for, for dra Dragapult maybe, but I'm just going to go for this. I think this is fine. Dang, they didn't go for the ground type move into Colossal. I could have just waited a turn. Maybe I should have been a little bit more risky. Because it was definitely either Ice Attack into... Dragapult or ground attack into Colossal, but I really thought they were gonna go for fake out and just try to KO my Colossal Let's See how much this does is it sash? It's probably sash, but It's not sash <laughs> Oh man, I wonder if they went for will-o-wisp incineroar. Hello? Hello? Excuse me? Who's running Will-O-Wisp Incineroar? I mean, I guess I took a KO, so it's probably fine. I mean, if I get Colossal and Dragapult on the field again later, like, I'm sure that will be okay. 
Okie dogie is here. He's just Okie. Um, I'm just gonna double the Incineroar slot, honestly. I feel pretty decent about that. If I lose Chen Pao Dragon, I, like, I don't need it anymore. Okay, Incineroar switches out. Yeah, that's fair. What comes in? What's your last mod? Roaring Moon does not want to eat this. Say goodbye to your Roaring Moon, I guess. Is it booster speed? Okay, well... <laughs> Yeah, Ro Roaring Moon does not eat this attack. And then Chien is going to go down to like 1 HP. Wow, that's a lot. That's still a lot of damage for being burned. Goodbye, Roaring Moon. Peace out. Okie Dogie was probably the only Mon that could have switched in on that attack. And obviously it's on the field. Oh no. You knocked me down to Focus Sash. Whatever will I do? I think what I'm going to do is... Um, what's the safest play? What are they going to do? I think they're going to drain punch the Dragonite slot, if I'm being honest. So I think what I'm going to do is switch Chien Pao into Colossal. And switch uh, Dragonite into Dragapult. Let's see. If I get this right, it's going to be big, guys. If I get this right, it's going to be big. We just got to get it right. If I got it wrong, I'm going to be sad. Because I could have just stayed in, probably. Well, no. I, I guess I have to switch out Dragonite no matter what. Because, okay, yeah. Fake out into the into the Dragonite slot. Drain Punch. Bulk up! Okay. All right. That's a move you can click. Hmm. Do I explode? I think I just explode. Because, like, what do I have to lose? You know what I mean? They're not going to knock out Dragapult here. The Okie Dogie is going to get pretty scary if it gets too many bulk ups up. But like... Yeah. I'm just going to explode. I'm going to surf and I'm going to explode. And that's probably going to be just fine. Because they won't get any HP back. Because the Drain Punch is going to go into is going to go into Dragapult. I think this is the best play. Kaboom, baby. Goodbye. I might miss KOs, but let's see. This might not KO Incineroar. Oh, it does. It's just straight up a KOs. That's so funny. Now show me Drain Punch into the Dragapult slot. That would be that would be just like the icing on the cake. <laughs> oh, that's so nice. Um, Okie Dogie effectively... I mean, it, it could have knocked off, I guess. Um, let's think about this. I guess we just go Chien Pao. Let's see, if they have Bulk Up and Drain Punch... They probably don't have a Dark-type move unless they're not running Protect. Um, Ice Spinner, I think, is still gonna do the most damage. Because they're only at plus one defense. And I'll just Dragon Darts. I don't think there's any way that they can win, but... Who knows? Maybe this Okie Dogie's got that dog in him and he can pull out the 4v1. I do have Stomping Tantrum on Dragapult too, so... Or on Dragonite. So as soon as one of these mons goes down, like, I do have a super effective attack into it. They didn't Terra at all, did they? No. Interesting. They could ter Terrastalize, but I really feel like... Oh. It looks like Dragon Darts just does it. Yeah. Goodbye. Goodbye, Okie Dogie. Goodbye! <laughs> uh, what a great... That was such a good game. It was such a fast game, too. We were in control that whole game. I love this team. This team is so fun. Did I need to explode? Probably not. But it definitely prevented them from getting a bunch of HP back from Drain Punch and taking a free KO. Like, if I'm going to get knocked out anyway, like, I might as well. You know what I mean? Uh, okay. This is not ideal. Um, hmm. Harkonine's actually pretty scary, if I'm being honest. What do I do here? Hmm. Yeah, I mean, I think my best four is just this, right? I could bring Urshifu, but they have Water Pond and Raging Bolt. 
I don't really necessarily need Urshifu to deal with Landorus because I do have Chien Pao. You know, one day I'll record my audio separate from the game audio and everything will be hunky-dory, but that day is not today, unfortunately. All right, yeah, Articuno Ninetales is the lead. Now, the only problem here is what happens if I miss Explosion? Because I definitely could just Explosion here. Um, I think I'm just going to go for the Surf play. I think that's my best play. Terra Water, Terra Blast would be, yeah, they're going to Terrastalize. What's the Terra? It's Ice. Okay. Yeah, that's fair. Usually the Terra here is Ice. I can definitely land Rock Slide, but what, the odds are not in my favor here. I don't know that I eat a Blizzard, so I might just lose this game straight up. The Ice, the ice coverage is really good into what I brought. But if I land this rock slide, I think we'll be okay. Surf. Well, surf connects. Not that that's really that important. If I if I can land this rock slide into both Pokemon, I think we can win. I don't know if we eat the blizzard, because I don't know, like... Is this exactly the team from that regional? I don't miss? Oh, it hasn't been decided yet? I don't miss? <laughs> Oh, that's so good. I think I think the one in the rental, the one that won the regional was Specs. Uh, this might just take two KOs. Let's see. No, Colossal hangs on. Colossal the Chad. Let's go, Colossal. All right, bet, 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 bet. What do I bring in? Um, let me think. It's got to be. It's got to be Chien Pao, I guess. I don't know what their last... I don't know what mons are coming in. Nothing with Fake Out is amazing. Okay, that's great. Um, I might just go ahead and click Rock Slide again. I mean, I really don't have a better move. I think I'm going to go... Well? Hmm. Yeah, I think I have to do this. I have to make sure I KO the Articuno here. If Articuno goes down, I don't think they have anything else that can beat Chien Pao Dragonite. Follow me is fine. Uh, Colossal's faster. As long as I don't miss, we're okay. We missed. We missed Ogre Pond, though! Oh my god! <laughs> Goodbye! <laughs> Your Articuno has been sacrificed to the Colossal Gods. And Colossal gets to just sit here, because it's weakness policy and not like Life Orb or anything. We survive another turn. Sacred Sword. 50%? Oh, a little bit less than 50%, but that's pretty good. Okay, Harkonine comes in. Yeah, that's fair. I should be able to win this, but I have to get rid of Ogre Pond. Um, there's probably an Extreme Speed coming. I can't really do a whole lot about it. What I'm going to do is just click Sacred Sword into the Harkonine slot, and I have to just go for a Rock Slide. I don't have another play. No extreme speed? That's bold. This just takes two KOs. <laughs> Why didn't they extreme speed? They needed to extreme speed there. They needed to like follow me extreme speed to like have any chance. Man, that's so good. We're we're cracked, guys. Oh, I know I was lucky to get the rock slide like to connect into Articuno still, but that's so good. The one thing that I do enjoy about um, Colossal and Scarlet and Violet is that you can run it really bulky because really the fastest thing that you want to outspeed is just like Dragapult. And I don't even think, I, I am running enough speed to outspeed Dragapult. You don't have to worry about like running enough speed to outspeed like Regieleki or Venusaur in the sun or anything because it's not worth it. Oh, uh, Lilical is kind of concerning. But like... Okay, let's think about this for just a second. If I'm this guy, am I going to lead Lilical? Because that's like worst case scenario for me, right? Is they lead Lilical? Because I can deal with the Trick Room lead. What do they do if I just lead Chimpow Dragonite? Yeah, I think that's my best lead. And then I think we have to go... I can bring Colossal in the back, though. Yeah. I think I'm going to go Colossal in the back, and then... 
Rillaboom in the back. I think that's what I want. If they lead, if they lead Trick Room, I'm gonna cry because I could have just led Colossal for free. Okay, okay, that's interesting. That's so interesting, huh? Now we have to ask ourselves a question: Which one of these Pokemon has Focus Sash? I think what I'm gonna do is Ice Spinner the Regieleki slot, and. Yeah, I'm gonna commit to Terra, I think. I think I'm gonna do this. If it's the Urshifu that's Sash, then I'll just cry. But I think we can knock it out if it's not Sash. And I don't think Regieleki can really hurt us like that that much. I'm basically just terrestrializing for extra damage. Ooh, they're smart. They did it. They did the play. Is this, is this, wait, is this Regieleki gonna explode? Okay, that's fine. I'm actually okay with that. I don't need Chien Pao to be faster. That tells me that this Urshifu probably is Sash, though. Which is a little bit of an issue. Um, let me think about this here. What do I want to do? What are they gonna do? Are they gonna close combat, or... Because I don't have Sucker Punch. Which actually puts me in a really awkward position. I think I'm going to... Ooh, I wish I was running a priority move on my uh, Chien Pao right now. Because doubling this Urshifu would be kind of free. Alright. Here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to protect. I'm going to extreme speed the Urshifu again. I don't think... I don't know if this is a good play, but we're going to find out. I think we might just lose something this turn oh they actually just eat that that's crazy that's a bulky urshifu what do they go for just like close combat into dragonite yeah it's unfortunate but there wasn't a whole lot i could do about it that's really bad actually I wish, if I had Sucker Punch on this Chien Pao, we'd be cooking so good right now, but I don't, unfortunately. That speed drop's actually really huge. Let me think about this. I'm gonna go Rillaboom. Rillaboom at least, uh... Can... I think what I want to do is... Crunch here. Grassy Glide here. This Reggie like he's only clicked Electroweb so far. I'm kind of um, inclined to believe maybe it can only click Electroweb. Mm. I went for this play because I figured they'd probably have to protect. Yeah, another Electroweb is fine. I don't have to lose anything for that. We're going to KO Aleki with uh, Chien Pao. We're kind of in a bad position, though. I feel kind of sad about this game because it could have been really good. In fact, if I had just led Dragapult Colossal, we'd be, like, cooking right now because who cares about that Electro Web? What comes in? Mmm. What does that tell me? That tells me that probably their Mon in the back has Trick Room stuff. What do I want to do? Am I okay with losing Chien Pao here? I might be. What if I just double the Cresselia? I could also get a... No, it's a defense drop. I'm going to double... Hmm... What if I do this? Do they Terra Cresselia? No Terras. Oh no! Bro, I hate Urshifu. <laughs> if Urshifu just didn't have Aqua Jet, I'd feel so good. <clears throat> I'm coughing so much for the, during this game too. They're gonna set up Trick Room. The question is, is it Torkoal in the back or is it Ursa Luna in the back?
They're probably just gonna Lunar Blessing, right? I can't really do anything about that. All I can do is this. I guess I could Fake Out. Yeah, I'm gonna Fake Out. And... I'm gonna Rock Slide. I think that's my best play. Because I think there's no way this Urshifu goes for an attack this turn, right? This dude... I got, like, super up paired for this game, too. This dude is way higher on the ladder. That no protect from the Urshifu is very concerning. I eat that, actually. But I get weakness policy. So, like, maybe that's okay. But getting Steam Engine when Trick Room, up, tr Trick Room is up is actually not great. We do get the KO on Urshifu, though. And I can probably KO the Cresselia, but... Like, it's, it, like it might be in uh, Grassy Glad range. I kind of think I want it to be Ursa Luna. It is. Okay. Hmm. So what do I want to do here? Where does the damage need to go? I think I'm going to go for the KO here. I'm going to go for a Flare Blitz. Protect is the play I was expecting. They're gonna Terastalize next turn. Ally switch? Excuse me? They have no reason to ally switch in that position. Did you think I was gonna double the Lunala? Or the Lunala? The Cresselia? How many turns of Trick Room are left, too? That's kind of important. Rillaboom's at full HP. I don't need a facade, though. But I, I think they can only knock out one of my Pokemon here. I only got one turn of Grassy Terrain. And there's two turns of Trick Room left. Okay. Hmm. So I think what I have to do is go for a Wood Hammer. And a Flare Blitz. Ooh. Maybe I have to click Explosion. No. No, that's that always loses me the game, actually. Huh? Earthquake. Okay, I win. Well, then I win. Because, first of all, the Earthquake's half power. Because there's grassy terrain out. You're stupid. Um, second of all, I clicked Woodhammer. So I always get this KO. They didn't even Terra. Did they Terra something? They didn't Terra anything else. They should have Terra'd the Ursa Luna if they had the option to. I feel like I always would have gone for the Terra there. Not to mention, if I had Protect on Colossal, like, I could have just saved Colossal, too. I didn't think we were going to win that game. Um, okay, well, that's it. That's the video. We did a good job today. Good job, us. I'm so proud of us. Um, did you enjoy this video? If you enjoyed this video, be sure to leave me a like down below. And go ahead and, you know, comment. Clickety-clack that keyboard. Give me, give me something good down there. Tell me what you want to see in the future, you know, all that kind of stuff. Join the Andyla Discord server. There's a link down in the description. Um, and subscribe. Be an Andyla fan today. With that, everyone, my name's Andrew. I'll catch you guys next time. Once upon a time, man, I heard that I was struggling. Came from a gym where power creep wasn't coming in. Face long, stats tight, defense up, shack height. Sturdy on me, sash like, got the TM last night. Hit me with that good move, make this mountain act right. Bast boys, better hit that builder. I know that's right. Big Bast busting out these body presses, better buy a body bag.